in the space of 24 hours, two people were killed by electricity in Sironko district. The man, a retired soldier from Buhora sub-county, stepped on a live wire on his way home from a drinking joint, while the woman died on her way to the garden. We have lost three Ugandans. Two. Two Ugandans, one here and one in Ibuaras. If this is confirmed to be a case of electrocution, then it will probably vindicate us, because we've had the, some bit of resistance in Sironko. And it is where it has happened. It is not that you, we are celebrating the death, but uh, we are saying this is what happens if we don't do anything about the problem. Elgon region is rated the highest in the country in illegal electricity connections. Despite the fact that Umeme and police started an operation to crack down on the illegal power connections, people ignore the dangers associated to them. Because even as I talk now, even around here, we have already recovered the illegal small, small wires, illegal they normally use to connect. So we have record, recovered some of those wires. Uh, we are having them probably as a, as exit. Let us not uh, underlook this problem. Let us take the bull by the horn and fight it together from all angles, religious, political, user, uh, Ego user, all of us should join hands and get rid of this problem. According to authorities in the district, about 8 to 10 people die of electrocution every month. But uh, since this operation of women uh, started, I think this is now the, the first murder we have seen since it started the last month. They have called on Umeme and security operatives in the district to step up the operation against illegal connections. If they continue as police, we cannot sit back uh, uh, when people are, are dying like this.